So you got your Ring Video Doorbell second generation and want to set it up for the first time with any of your Android phone. Well, let's hop in and see how to do that. For that, first make sure to download the Ring Always Room app from your Play Store. Open the app. You can just go ahead and create an account in case you don't have one or just go ahead and sign into an existing one. We're going to sign in with our existing account. Verify account when prompted. After logging into account, hopefully you are getting into this page. Tap on set up a device right from here. Choose doorbells. Now when you're prompted here, take off the back plate or back cover from your doorbell and scan the QR code. When you're ready for scanning, just tap on I'm ready to scan. Allow the camera. Now if you're unable to scan your QR code for any reason, go to other options at the bottom. And from here, you can also go for the barcode instead, or you can just go straight for can scan the QR code option. There's a code right below the QR code on your doorbell. Just enter that code manually. From this list, select video doorbell second generation. Enter the five digit pin code from the back of your doorbell. Now if you already set up an address, go with it, or you can just add a new one right from here. I'm going with my previous address by pressing continue. Name your doorbell from this list, or you can custom name it as well. I'm going with office. Now I've already fully charged my doorbell. If you haven't, just go ahead, charge it and then press continue. Now there are some serious installation instructions. Read it carefully. And after that, press OK. Tap on this box and press continue. Remove the protective film at the front and then tap on I've removed the film. To set up the Wi-Fi, first make sure you have the Wi-Fi password ready. OK, tap on I have my password and then press OK. Allow it. Allow location access. Yeah, while using the app. Yes, I'm near the device. I hope you are as well. You should see a wireless spinning at the front of your doorbell. If you can't see it, don't worry. Just press at the orange button at the back of your doorbell just for a few seconds and you will get this light. Tap on light is spinning white. That means it's on setup mode. Now in setup mode. Press OK. From the pop-up, just tap on your Ring's name. Now connected to the Ring app. And when you end up in this section, select the Wi-Fi you want to use with your Ring doorbell, Wi-Fi password, and then press continue to connect your Ring doorbell with your Wi-Fi. Connecting to Wi-Fi. Just a moment. Yeah, the Wi-Fi is connected. Press continue to the next word. Setup successful. Now the setup is done. You will just here walk through some basic features and that's all. Skip a few for now. Don't worry. You can set up everything after you have set up. Just follow the prompts and increase or decrease the motion sensitivity. Continue. Set up the motion frequency according to your own preference. We recommend you to set it up periodically. It will save your battery. But if you want otherwise, of course, you can set it up with any of these three. Press continue. Set up the features. Yeah. Default is fine by me. You can set it up any way you like. When you're done, just press done and press continue. It's done and the setup is complete. Now just go ahead, install a ring doorbell to wherever you want at your house and you can control the live view right from your Android phone. So that's how you can easily set up your ring doorbell second gen with any of your Android phone. It may take a moment to answer. Please wait. Thanks for watching and take care.